chocolate, peanut butter, pie, baby. Grab your card, your cart, and the nearest fork. This one's coming in hot. Not to put a label on it, but we're all in a serious relationship with this Costco fave. You guys, it's finally here, and Instagram is going crazy for it. We can't deny that the most delicious reason to get a Costco membership is to take advantage of the sweet treats, decadent pastries, and cookies from the bakery section. Most of those baked goods are crafted in-house, so we can expect everything to taste fresh and high quality. Of course, Costco's portions are built for a party, but with this little number on your menu, you can please any crowd. I got a Costco haul! Perhaps one of the most popular foods to come out of the Costco bakery is its selection of pies. From the iconic pumpkin pie that saved many a lazy chef's Thanksgiving, to its double-crust apple pie for the loyalists, the reviews are in. Costco pies are solid gold eaten. But if you're asking longtime fans, the chocolate peanut butter pie is in a category all its own. The newest flavor dropped just in time for Pie Day, which is celebrated every year on March 14th. It's a hefty 4.75-pound dessert, and according to one Costco member on Instagram, this one is perfect. We're drooling over the rich and creamy peanut butter layer along with that impossibly fluffy chocolate layer, luscious and smooth, bite after decadent bite. This instant fan favorite retails for $19.99, and it features a generous helping of airy chocolate mousse sitting atop the silkiest, creamiest peanut butter, all nestled inside a beautifully buttery graham cracker crust. And as if it could get any more perfect, it's finished off with a few dollops of sweet whipped cream. Costco fans are all about this new addition to the bakery case, with one commenting, I'm pregnant and can't wait to try this. But some wondered what to do with so much pie. I didn't know any better. I'd say you've been eating too much pie. Nearly five pounds of peanut butter and chocolate mousse might be a little too much for some people to wrap their minds around, but another commenter suggested cutting and freezing individual slices. Then they can be thawed as needed when the craving strikes. Hey, even if you don't let it thaw, a slice of frozen mousse pie is perfect as is. You might actually prefer this pie cold because it will hit a little closer to ice cream. On pie day, all sorts of restaurants and famous brands typically introduce new pie-themed items or offer deals on pizza pies, fruit pies, and cream pies. All the pies. But it's the perfect excuse to indulge even after pie day is over, because anytime is a good reason to eat some pie. Especially with a classic combo like this. It wasn't a dream. We may have Kellogg's cereal mogul, Dr. John Harvey Kellogg, to thank for bringing peanut butter to the masses in the early 1900s. Initially promoted as a health food around the same time, the creamy treat made a splash at the St. Louis World's Fair, thanks to C.H. Sumner, who was working a concession stand. But the heart wants what the heart wants, and the iconic partnership between chocolate and peanut butter began. As the story goes, Mr. Hershey and Mr. Reese put peanut butter on our chocolate and chocolate on our peanut butter, just like the 1970s commercial told us. In 1928, dairy farmer Harry Reese, who worked for Milton Hershey, invented one of the most iconic combinations in flavor history. My chocolate is in my peanut butter. It, it's doggone good. We happily celebrate this timeless and delicious combo today. And expertly baked into a chocolate and peanut butter pie, the pairing stands on its own. But add a hot cup of coffee or a scoop of vanilla ice cream and you'll be cruising into the Costco stratosphere. However you serve it, this is sure to be a memorable finale to any meal. If you love chocolate and peanut butter, you'll be happy you had this baby saved in the freezer especially if it ends up being a limited time or seasonal bakery item. Even more reason to buy more than one. You never know which new Costco treat will become your ultimate favorite, or how long it will last before it sells out. Let's be honest, we're definitely getting a whole one for ourselves and putting our chocolate and PB devotion to the test. Another great Sunday, and not too rough on the old pocketbook.